Hi, this is Chris, and we have this nice used bike, uh, U500 version 3, that Sue's dad gave us. Unfortunately, uh, it didn't work, even though the uh, it was plugged in, the charger light was green. Batteries apparently had died. I'm guessing it's the BMS board that went on it. And so we ordered a new one, but I figured I'd take the old battery apart and see what we could do with it. The battery box is huge here. It goes underneath the rack. And they make uh, three different size batteries, a 15, a 22, and a uh, 33 amp battery. This was a 22 amp hour battery. The battery charger is a 48 volt, 3 amp charger. So here you can see the battery pack's been removed from the aluminum case. So this 22 amp hour battery had um, 117 cells in it. It's a 13S 9P battery. You can see that the battery holder had empty cells in it and they were crushed. I checked and there wasn't any voltage, so I went ahead and cut off each of the spot wells and took the cells apart. So what I'm doing is I'm taking them all out. And right now, initially, when you check the voltmeter, there are only like 0.8 volts. So they're not enough that the chargers will actually charge it. So I'm taking my power supply and I set it to about three volts and I'm just uh, giving a little quick charge for 30 seconds to get it uh, back up to about three volts. So I have a Zanflare charger slash tester. It tells you a bunch of things about the cells. It tells you the, the voltage of the cell. It will tell you the internal resistance. And then it has a mode where it will discharge the battery and recharge it and it will tell you what the capacity of the battery is. So I tested all 117 batteries and 81 of them were bad and 36 of them were uh, good enough to use. I was sitting in bed trying to think of what to do with all these batteries then the power went out and my CPAP machine stopped and then I knew what to do. You can buy a CPAP battery backup on Amazon for about 300 bucks but I thought I'd go ahead and try to see if I could reuse these cells. Bruins makes these battery kits for the 18650 cells that are like Legos. You snap them together, you don't need to do any spot welding. 24 Samsung 26F cells, I was able to configure them as 4S6P, so I had approximately a 16 volt battery management board mounted on top that prevents the batteries from being over or undercharged. Battery pack consumes energy, it drops from 16 volts down to 12 volts. So I put a down converter on it so that it all puts 12 volts. Put together a test with a USB charger, a power inverter, and a 12 volt fan. And I was able to run the system for 237 watt hours. For about $100 of parts, I was able to repurpose the e-bike batteries into a CPAP battery backup system, a 12 volt system with about 15.6 amp hours or 230 watt hours of power.